हरि ओम स्टूडेंट हियर इज अवर नैक्स्ट क्लास दट इट इज इंटीजर्स पार्ट टू इन दिस् क्लास वी आर् गोयिंग टू डिस्क अबउट पॉजिटिव इंटीजर्स अंड नेगटिव इंटीजर्स इन डेथ अंड देर आपरेश हाउ टू आपरेट इन अडिशन सप्राशन मलटिप्लिकेशन all these things in this uh, uh, for how to represent uh, positives that it is positive integers and how to represent uh, negative integers all these things we are going to discuss see that for uh, let me to take uh, some example that it in our daily life how we are using the positive integers and negative integers a uh, first example is if a person who gains profit in a business we can denote with positive uh, plus sign that it is positive integer meaning if one gains then uh, we can represent with the positive meaning If a person gained three thousand rupees in a business, means we can represent with the plus three thousand. If the same person incurred loss in the business, then we can represent it as negative sign. If he uh, uh, incurred a loss of two uh, thousand rupees, then we can represent the same with negative sign so if it is profit plus and if it is a loss minus on overall what about his financial status means here both one is positive another one is negative so that we have to subtract by subtracting we can get plus 1000 only no why because here greater one is positive so that on overall his financial status is in profit only coming to a next example see this is uh, ground level if we are going down then we can take that depth as negative integers that means uh, in mines uh, whoever works they will go down to the below ground level that depth we can denote with negative numbers that means if they are traveling towards uh, if they travel towards uh, 200 meters uh, uh, to the below ground level we can represent the same with minus 200 meters if uh, a an aeroplane is flying above the ground level with a height of 500 5000 meters then it is from the ground level it is plus 5000 meters understood the difference how we are taking positive integers and negative integers so if it is this is a ground level to the below we are considering the uh, the length that it is its depth as with the negative sign and for the ground level above we are considering it as positive integers so likewise we can take in our daily life 
the uh, these are the best examples by using all these examples or in our uh, education field also if one gains uh, positive marks and uh, um, let me to take uh, for example in a quiz test a student scored in the first round uh, 50 marks then we can take that as plus 50 if uh, he scored that it is uh, that uh, uh, he failed to answer correctly then he lost 10 marks means we can take that uh, uh, 10 marks we can represent that 10 marks with negative symbol that it is for correct answer he scored plus 50 for incorrect answer he lost minus 10 so on overall his uh, score means we can denote with plus 40 why because this is positive integer and this is a negative integer so if uh, there are different signs we have to subtract then we have to put a greater one symbol that it is plus so it is plus 40 so by these are uh, from these three examples once again i'll recall you addition properties of integers if two integers having same sign that it is either positive or negative that means minus po uh, both positive integers or both negative integers we have to add if one is positive other one is negative we have to subtract and finally for the result we have to put greater number a larger number symbol sign that it is if the greater number contains positive sign we have to put positive symbol for the result if the greater one contains negative sign then we have to put negative sign to the result this is about uh, addition rules of uh, integers now multiplication under multiplication if both the integers plus plus for result also plus if both are negative result positive one is positive other one is a negative for result negative in the same way minus into plus is equal to minus these are the rules of uh, integers under multiplication and for addition i discussed with you and one more important thing if bracket brackets appears in a numerical expression first uh, you, you you have to remove the brackets how to remove the brackets removal of bracket is most important in a numerical expression then only uh, we will get exact answer exact result why because if uh, in a numerical expression if we have brackets 
compulsorily we have to remove removal of bracket means removal of bracket means multiplying the signs which are inside and outside of the brackets only signs first we should simplify them that it is we should multiply the signs then only after that we have to uh, do the simplification that it is numerals simplification these are the uh, important points in today's class here is a problem uh, keep your textbooks beside of you and uh, observe this problem in this problem they have given that a boy jack uh, secured positive uh, marks for correct answers negative marks for incorrect answers and his score in five successive rounds given that 25 minus 5 minus 10 15 and 10 so here is our question is what is his total marks at the end how to calculate his uh, total marks at the end means here in first round he scored 25 again in the second round for incorrect answer it is minus 5 so that plus of minus 5 and in the third round again minus 10 plus of minus 10 fourth round plus 15 so it is correct answer in fifth round 10 marks so uh, in fourth round and fifth round he gave correct answers second round third round wrong answers that is incorrect answers so first also uh, 25 that is also positive i said how to simplify uh, in a problem if they have given both positive negative means if uh, both are same signs that it is either positive or negative same signs then we can add if uh, one is positive other one is negative then we have to simplify for that here see that 25 plus of minus minus 5 minus 10 plus 15 plus 10 now how to uh, simplify this means add all positive numbers that it is plus 25 plus 15 plus 10 totally it is 50 that it is plus 50 coming to negative numbers that it is minus 10 minus 5 it is minus 15 so here positive negative again we have to subtract so that it is 10 minus 5 5 4 minus 1 3 here greater 1 symbol is positive so that plus 35 so uh, his total marks at the end is 35 here all are uh, all are 35 here see this plus 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 so that you cannot get any change in the answer we can directly simplify 25 minus 5 20 plus 20 minus 10 plus 10 plus 10 plus 15 plus 25 plus 25 plus 10 
plus 35. Like that also we can. But here if the same problem in case in the middle if we have a negative sign then we have to remove bracket compulsorily. Then only the simplification becomes easier and you will get exact terms. Here in this problem they have given a statement we have to verify that term. That it is a minus of minus b is equal to a plus b. We have to check it out that statement for this numbers that it is a is 21 b is 18. When we compare these two you can get a is greater than b only. That's it now. Now take LHS part of this statement that it is 21 minus of minus 18. In the before problem itself I told you if uh, between the numbers if you have positive sign then we can do our simplification directly. Whereas in case of a negative sign definitely we have to remove the bracket. In the before class itself I explained you how to remove signs uh, how to remove brackets. Meaning uh, the signs which are inside and outside of the bracket first we should multiply them. That it is here you will get 21 minus into minus it is plus 18 by this simplification that it is by this multiplication we removed bracket it is plus 18 now it is both are same signs then we can add we can get 39 now coming to RHS that it is right hand side of this uh, equation 21 plus 18 as I said if they have both are same signs we can add so by adding we can get 39 so now LHS of this uh, equation is equal to RHS no hence verified LHS is equal to RHS Hence it is verified. The same second one in this in the first problem A greater than B. Second problem I have taken A is 118 that is 118. B is 125 125. A is less than B here. So when A is greater than B, this statement is, this equation is uh, verified and it is uh, true. Now we are going to check when A is less than B. See that 118 minus of minus 125 is equal to 118 plus 125. Wherever bracket appears in a problem then we can read it as of that it is 118 minus of minus 125 is equal to 118 plus 125 and at the same time as I discussed with you wherever brackets are there means we have to remove how to remove the brackets that it is by multiplying the signs which are inside and outside of the bracket. That it is minus into minus plus 125. Now by adding these two we can get that 8 plus 5 13. 1 2 it is 3 plus 1 4 2 it is 243. Now coming to RHS 
125 it is both same signs positive positive so that we can add then we will get 243 so that LHS is equal to RHS hence it is verified so if either A greater than B or A less than B A minus of minus B is equal to A plus B use the sign of here is on left hand side we have a numerical expression and on right hand side we have another numerical expression we are comparing these two numerical expressions using less than greater than or equal to if these two numerical expressions are joined by either less than greater than then it is a statement if it is joined by an equal to um, uh, by equal to sign it becomes an equation here in this statement it is on left hand side part LHS minus 8 plus of minus 4 same signs we can add directly and we can put it as minus 12 uh, and um, but in case of minus it will be changes that it is see that minus 8 plus of minus minus 4 it is minus 12 now on RHS minus 8 minus of minus 4 that it is minus 8 minus of minus it is plus 4 so one is negative another one is positive so that we have to subtract and for some time ignore the signs compare these two 8 is greater than 4 so that we have to put 8 sign that it is 8 is having negative so that it is minus 4 now this side it is minus 12 and on right hand side it is minus 4 first ignore the signs that it is 12 4 as you know it is uh, 12 is greater but in case of negative integers totally it is reverse so that minus 12 is less than minus 4 as we discussed in our previous class also while moving left of 0 the values becomes lesser so that it is minus 1 is a greater than minus 2 minus 2 is greater than minus 3 minus 3 is greater than minus 4 likewise so that minus 4 uh, minus 12 is less than minus 4.